Hi, welcome to Berwick Mitsubishi. My name is Josh and today we're doing a walk around video on this 2018 Mitsubishi Outlander LS. I'm going to walk you through the condition and some of the features of the vehicle and show you just how well this vehicle has actually been looked after. Starting off at the front, as you can clearly see, it is Mitsubishi's brand new uh, dime, sorry, dynamic shield look at that front end. And you do get that Mitsubishi badge right in the middle of that beautiful silver grill there. Now along the side you do get those really sharp headlights with the DRL that runs through the middle there. And those headlight bulbs there, the projector beam does give you a very clear cutter for your headlight. You've got the fog lights down the bottom. And if we make our way along to the first alloy wheel, it is in really good condition. Plenty of tread left in those tyres. I do believe they're almost brand new. And very well designed by Mitsubishi with that chrome look, with that subtle... Uh, gunmetal grey titanium look between the between the chrome. You've got colour coded side mirrors and door handles. You've also got an indicator built into the side mirror so it does clean up the whole side of the car and it is keyless entry so just pressing that button there does lock it and fold the mirrors in and when you press it again folds the mirrors out and unlocks the car. Having a look inside as you can see bolsters and everything look like it's barely actually been sat on so really good for to show how careful the previous owner has been getting in and out of the vehicle and all the doors minimal scuffs which tells me the previous owner has been very careful to not kick their doors open now the back windows are privacy glass which is a dyed glass so it is a little bit darker it does keep the whole back of the vehicle nice and private hence privacy glass but I would recommend matching it with darkest legal tint that way you get the UV protection as well that next alloy wheel once again really good condition completely unmarked still plenty of tread in the tire as well making our way along the back now as you can see we've got those led tail lights there which do look incredible tying from the side fender to the tailgate and you've got that chrome uh, split in the tailgate in the middle there if we open this up the thing i love about the back of these outlanders is the fact that you do get a clean 50 50 split with these seats so you can actually just fold it completely flat and you don't lose any space in the back and you can still have someone sit very comfortably here as well. If we lift this up, you do also get a cargo blind in the back here. So if you did want to uh, put both back seats down and hide whatever you've got in the back, you've got the privacy of that as well. A colour matched rear parking sensors here. And I will point out, even if I'm being, just because I'm being super picky, there is one very minor scuff there, but nothing really too concerning because it is on the plastic, so not in the paintwork paintwork all the way along this side is in really good condition that next alloy wheel once again completely unmarked there's still plenty of tread left in those tires making our way down as I'm being very picky with this car I haven't actually been able to spot anything else out that needs to be pointed out at all but that next alloy wheel once again completely unmarked and that's the one that usually cops the most amount of scratches because it's parked next to the curb so uh, two brand new tires on the front four perfect condition wheels and the paintwork looks absolutely spot on. So what we're going to do now is have a look at the engine. Under the bonnet now, what we have is a four-cylinder 2.4 litre petrol engine. The vehicle itself does have a six-speed sports automatic gearbox. You do get a five-star ANCAP safety rating with seven airbags, which is awesome to know that you're nice and safe in your new family car. You've got 124 kilowatts of power from this engine with 220 newton meters of torque. Now where it really stands out is its fuel economy. So you've got a 60 litre petrol fuel tank which runs on 91 fuel. Fuel consumption is an amazing 7.2 litres per 100 which will see you an average fuel distance depending on your driving style of about 833 kilometres from a full tank. Taking a look inside the Outlander now, just on the driver's side door you do get your power window controls. Front driver's side is automatic. Just above that is the central locking buttons and the lock button for your power windows. Above that again is the toggle for your side mirrors. So there is a button there that actually lets you fold them in as well. On the right hand side of the steering wheel we've got your forward collision mitigation, lane departure warning, parking sensors, and just up here, you've got a headlight adjuster to change the angle of your headlights, track and traction control, and a button that looks like a credit card, which lets you switch through the digital display between the clusters. Being the LS, you do also get your automatic headlights and automatic high beams, and your indicators are on that side as well. You've also got automatic rain sensing wipers on the left here. On the steering wheel itself, very nice leather wrapped steering wheel, still in really good condition, very, actually there's no wear on it at all that I can see. But you've also got your adaptive cruise control which lets you actually set the same speed as the car in front of you. 
on the left hand side here all your media settings and your hands-free call settings we head on into the middle display now just going to put the car in reverse and as you can see very wide angle rear view camera there so uh, really good when you are uh, turning it back up and if you have a tow bar you can see the tow bar in terms of your media you've got am and fm radio you've also got digital radio and usb inputs which means you can use apple carplay and android auto to use google maps for your navigation just under here there is an eco mode if you wanted to save a little bit of fuel Dual zone, dual zone climate control meaning the passenger can have a separate temperature to the driver 12 volt socket there and a little key insert if you did want to put your key in there to um, start the car if the battery goes dead you've got two cup holders here which do cover up nice and neatly and that leather wrapped shifter there in amongst that uh, beautiful gloss black center console you've got a four wheel drive selector here which you can switch your four wheel drive mode between four wheel drive auto lock or eco electric park brake and auto hold there as well leather wrap center console when you open it up as you can see you've got two usb ports there a 12 volt socket and the cover for your 12 volt socket there and a little tray which uh, when you put it in you can keep a wallet or something in there and there are cable slots here if you didn't want to run cables out of that center console now if we pan around the interior you will notice that it is in really good condition something good about the back seat is that it does actually slide backwards and forwards to make more space behind the seat so much for taking the time out of your day to watch the walk around video on this beautiful outlander as you can see in this kind of condition it kind of be a bit silly to not look after your paintwork so please ask us about the glass coat because that's going to give you a lifetime warranty on the paintwork protect it for the lifetime of the car and because it is going to be a long-term investment for you you're going to want it to look exactly like it does now years and years down the track so uh, please ask us about it because it will protect it from fading oxidization bird droppings bat droppings and a variety of other environmental damages that every single car goes through if you have any questions about that as i said do not hesitate to ask us the other thing i would recommend is the premium mechanical protection plan because that's going to give you an extra five years of cover on 181 electrical and mechanical components of the vehicle and give you 10 years of platinum roadside assist unlimited claims at three thousand six hundred dollars per claim so plenty of value there and if you're using our in-house finance mario or julie would love to talk to you about your finance options and help tailor a package to suit your needs which will work everything in there for you as well now just before i go have a look at our google reviews as well 4.8 stars with 990 plus reviews from customers australia wide so people enjoy dealing with us we make the process easy and we like to ensure that you are getting into a good quality vehicle from the right people so the number once again is 99070555 my name is josh and thank you so much for watching